Hey friends, Donovan here with fretspot.com. Got a uh, bass I want to share with you. I've uh, shown this bass before, but uh, it's so good it deserves many videos, not just one, so it's going to get them. So anyway, this is the uh, Fibonera bass. It's made in Hungary, and I got that wrong in the first video and kind of got chewed out by one of our European friends, so sorry for my ignorance of world knowledge. Um, but this thing is is absolutely gorgeous. Let's kind of look at it in case you haven't seen this uh, video before. So we got this crazy spalted burled uh, flame top that's just got like, obviously it's got spalts uh, there, burl there, uh, flame kind of all throughout it, uh, a multi-piece neck with flame all up and down the neck, uh, a um, tricolor fretboard which is amazing, matching headstock. I mean, this thing's crazy, and look at that neck through. Uh, it's really amazing. These guys are really, uh, they do something really cool. They basically make all everything in here. They make the uh, bridge, so this is their bridge. They make the pickups, they make the preamp, uh, they make everything. Um, they even make the case. They make their own case, um, which you can see here. And it's really cool. It's a hard shell case, and you know, honestly, normally I don't like hard shell cases. Uh, I, they offer maybe a little better protection than a normal, um, a high quality gig bag case, but they're usually super heavy, and I don't ever want to use them. But this case is really lightweight and super strong. It's basically a, a uh, fiber molded case. You've got a leather strip here on the edge there. That's leather. The handle is, I think, some kind of brushed aluminum and with wood underneath there. Uh, uh, it's just a really, really gorgeously done case. And on the inside, um, all of the insides are uh, custom fit for each instrument. So the instrument fits in there like a glove, which is fantastic. Uh, and so, and they even make their own case, which is really, really cool. Um, anyway, so I mentioned their own pickups, their own preamp. Um, so the and the preamp has these these uh, switches so you can put it in series uh, it's one for each pickup so series single coil and parallel uh, which is really cool and uh, it allows you to get kind of a real wide variety of of, of sounds out of it Let's see if i can get this to So this is a series. And here's a um, uh, parallel. And then a uh, single coil. Really pretty slick. So uh, this thing's just amazing. Uh, balance is great. You know, a lot of times these single cut bases look heavy and, and a lot of times they look that way because they are heavy. This thing is light. Um, I think if I remember right, it's like right at eight pounds, which is crazy, but it still sounds like barky and aggressive and it's just amazing. So anyway, let's, uh, let me shut up a little bit and let's play a little bass. Mm-hmm. 
of uh, one of my favorite uh, new basses here. This one is for sale, believe it or not. Uh, it seems like a lot of the uh, basses I've been showing lately have been sold, but this one's for sale. I'm gonna try, try to show you guys a few more that are for sale. Uh, always nice to show things you can actually buy. So uh, anyway, if you decide you want this one, let me know, or if you would like this one like this, but slightly different, I would be happy to work with you on getting one built. So drop me a line, Donovan at fretspot.com. As always, appreciate you guys watching and look forward to seeing you soon.